But in the future, we still think that coal can play a major role in a low carbon economy if we succeed particularly in carbon capture, utilization, and sequestration. Uh, I, I don't accept the idea that because carbon capture is expensive today, uh, it's, it's, quote, always going to be that way. But secondly, don't forget, we live in a country uh, that does not put any charge, uh, any direct price at least, on carbon dioxide emissions. The only reason you capture carbon dioxide, let's face it, is to keep it out of the atmosphere, right? It's not that it's, that it's, it's always going to be cheaper to release it than to capture it. The question is, with a very low cost for coal uh, uh, and a significant cost reduction in capture, does that become economically competitive with, with, uh, with alternatives? I don't know the answer. Our, our job is to, is to enable options. Does the Obama administration want to end the use of coal as a, as a utility fuel in this country? Well, if we did, we wouldn't have put $6 billion into CCS. Uh, the only thing is to understand is, make no bones about it, we start with the assertion, the commitment, that we are talking about a progressively lower carbon future but we have not abandoned coal as part of that future.